what's up YouTube um so I was talking about this on Twitter and you know some people just wanted to like I guess hear me say it in person but basically this is about the time that I saw Carl Thomas um I don't know Carl Thomas Carl Thomas does not know me um, this is not an interaction that he would remember. It, it just has nothing to do with anything. It's just, I saw Carl Thomas and I just thought it was kind of interesting um, to share the story. So what happened was I was walking home from the bodega and this was like about, I was writing about Klassen and Gates. And I noticed this car and it's like mad dudes, like just mad dudes like stacked up in the back, like just something like that, you know? And I'm just like, what what is going on? Like it just, it caught my eye enough that I was like, oh, okay. And um, when I looked and seen, and they were going, they're driving about maybe like, maybe 15 miles an hour. And so um, when I looked at, you know, the person in the passenger seat, it was enough to kind of catch my eye, like I said. So when I looked, the person in the passenger seat was Carl Thomas. So I'm looking like, it's Carl Thomas. And um, he, he saw me acknowledge him, and he kind of like sort of waved, and I just, I just, I didn't understand. And the car that they were in, you know, not that it's necessarily important, but it was like a, maybe like a 99 Accord. It was just confusing. Like, I don't understand why like seven dudes is stacked in a 99 Accord. Um, like for what, you know, where are you going? What, what has to happen here? What, what is happening? And I'm not even saying that to slander him. It wasn't anything. It didn't look necessarily any kind of negative way. It's just like, where do you need to go that this has to happen like this? Why couldn't y'all just have like called like a black car, you know what I'm saying? Call the cab company, call Adesibo, you know what I'm saying? Have them come pick up some of the dudes and these people can go with this dude, you know? I mean, I don't stack people in my car like that, so I don't really understand why Carl Thomas of all people would agree to do that. I mean, it's not like this was around a time when he probably was like hailing, like, you know, like sitting in Maybox or nothing like that. I mean, this is probably like about 07, 08 when I seen it. Um, and it just was just a little weird to me. Visually, it was just so much going on. It's like you got seven dudes, maybe eight, in a Honda Accord, in a you know, in an old school Honda Accord. Um, some people are sitting on top of each other in the back. I I don't understand this at all. Like I don't even see regular people do this. And I'm looking at the I just happened to catch his eyes, and it's Carl Thomas, and I I noticed it was him immediately because his hair was particularly shiny. Like it was sort of like that Jerry curl shiny, but kind of like. Like, maybe texturized, but you know how some people kind of got hair like that, but then they really don't, and they just put, like, they put carefree curl in it and things like that, sort of give it that sort of look. So it sort of looked like his hair, his hair looked um, manipulated. It didn't look like a jerry curl, but it looked like it was manipulated by a lot of products. So that's really just it. I mean, that is the extent of it. I've never seen Carl Thomas again, but I definitely saw Carl Thomas on Class and Gates and like a 99 Accord. It was like seven or eight dudes in a car. He was riding shotgun. He was not the one driving. He saw me. He acknowledged me with a head nod and like a, like a nice little smile or whatever. Just nothing, you know, crazy or anything like that. And him and his entourage, they just kept it moving. They were creeping, but they kept it moving. It wasn't anything crazy in that sense. I mean, the crazy thing was, was what I saw, but... I mean, they weren't, I didn't see any, like, weed smoke, you know, out the car. Um, I didn't see anybody that looked, like, inebriated. It just was a strange thing to see on Klassen and Gates, you know what I mean? So that's, that's really just, that's the story. There's nothing else to it.